<laughs> you're watching CBBC on two. Hello there, if you're just joining us. Yes, Merry Christmas, good everybody. indeed. Merry Christmas. Fantastic morning it's going to be today, isn't it? I, I can feel it in my water. Really? Yeah. That's fantastic. Now, we have a crab and fish Christmas special going on. If you want to take part, all you have to do is watch this VT very carefully and let us know who you think is going to cross the finish line first. Hmm, take a look at this. It's Christmas Crab and Fish! Hello Crab and Fish! Your challenge today is to bring your Christmas shopping back first! Are you ready? Go! Hmm, so if you've got any idea which one's going to win crab or fish, you can get in touch by giving us a call on 020-8811-2299. Or you can email us, you can give us your name, your contact details, and every which way we can get in touch with you. Uh, cbbc at bbc.co.uk. But now, it's time for a joke. Basil Sprouts. Who delivers presents to baby sharks at Christmas? <laughs> Santa Jules. <laughs> Merry Christmas from C. C. Oh, thanks, Baz. Anyway, if you do know uh, who's going to win crab or fish, that number again is 020 And we forgot to mention that this is what's up for grabs. Have a look at this. How can that not make you smile? It's fantastic. Anyway, you can also email cbbc at bbc.co.uk. Let us know how your Christmas preparations are getting underway. Right now, though, here's a little call for you. Part of your average family. You're watching CBBC on two. How's your Christmas shopping getting on, Otis? Oh, my Christmas shopping is yeah. getting uh, better than it has in the past. I've already got one present. I've got two more to, to buy, and I know what one of them is going to be. Do you know, I had an absolute nightmare this weekend. Really? I was in the supermarket, right, and this man was going, oh, do you know that we've got ice cream two for one? And he made me put them in my trolley. He looked he made you buy it. Yeah, he looked really upset when he said he, I wasn't going to take any. Right. And so I did just, because I'm in the Christmas spirit, so, yeah, you're so I thought that I would You're just, so giving, aren't you? I just you? thought I'd buy, like, two cartons of ice cream. Yeah? Anyway, uh, don't forget, earlier on this morning, we showed you a very special Christmas crab and fish. You guys have to watch this and work out which person is going to come over the finishing line first with all their Christmas shopping. Mm -hmm. So have a look. It's Christmas crab and fish. Hello, crab and fish. Your challenge today is to bring your Christmas shopping back first. Are you ready? Go! Oh, yes! Do you think that the, the crab's got fake tan on his face? Nah, that's natural, though. Do you think so? Yeah. Okay. We've got two callers on the line. Uh, on line one, we have Jamie. Hi, Jamie. Hello. Now, you're not feeling too well at the moment, are you? No. I've so, got this, this dancing reindeer will help sort your cold out, I think. Yeah. Um, who do you think's going to win? Fish. Fish, okay. Yeah. Okay, we've also got Rosie on the line, who I believe is not feeling too well either. Hi, Rosie, how are you? Fine, thank you. Are you feeling a bit bunged up? Yeah. I think it's hot water bottles all around you this yes. morning. Yeah. Uh, who do you think is going to win? Fish. Fish, okay, oh. well, let's have a look. Fish gets two votes. Done, Crab. You're today's winner. Well, I don't know why Fish is so upset. I mean, she's so You went window, window shopping? Shop. What are you doing, Fish? So, guys, I'm really, really sorry, but neither one of you have won that reindeer. I'm really sorry. Oh. All right, well, have a nice Christmas and get well soon, guys, all yeah, right? Yeah, and have a good 2003 as well. Yes. And don't miss this, which is coming new to the Saturday show. I want 10 bottles of water, I want a tray of fresh roasted turkey, chicken and tomatoes, two pink couches, a full length mirror, a dozen red roses, a gallon of orange juice, chocolate chip cookies, sweets, bananas and I want it now! The only thing Will and Gareth ask for is you. I'm very excited, not nervous yet but I will. Look, I'm sweating. You have a backstage pass to join Will and Gareth on tour. Starts this Saturday, 10.25 in the Saturday show. CBBC on BBC One. Be part of it. Do you know what, Otis? I'm thinking that diva at the beginning of that clip. Bananas are not very rock and roll. They're not, are they, really? No. Here's Jeopardy.
Here are Blue Peter's three essential ingredients for Christmas. First, add some sparkle and glamour. A Christmas spectacular more spectacular than any that's ever been seen before. And shake for an hour. Then stir in a generous amount of Christmas cheer. Happy Christmas! And finally, preserve all the magical moments of the past year. Blue Peter's Christmas specials start Monday. CBBC on BBC One. Make Christmas special with Blue Peter. You're watching CBBC on two. Now remember, at the end of this year, we're having a very glamorous award ceremony. It's called the 2002 It's Up To You Awards. And we want you guys to cast your minds back and think about the things you've most enjoyed here in CBBC in the past year. Now you guys, we already voted for Best Comedy and Best Info Show, but today we want you to turn your minds to entertainment. Yes, what has been the show that has really put a smile on your face? The one that you've enjoyed so much that it deserves your one precious vote. Have a look at the lineup. Up to you, Warren's best entertainment show. First up is Stitch Up. Did it make you laugh? How much did you enjoy it? Is it a winner? What about Bring It On with Dick and Dom? Yeehaw, cowboy! It's pretty good. It's good, that's good. Yeah. Or maybe it was 50 50, schools going up against each other and doing battle over inflatables. Or did you enjoy watching Get You On Back? What better way with London with lots of guns? That was clear. <laughs> or was it the next big thing, the talent show that spotted the next big thing? Yeah. Well, it's up to you, so get voting. And if you do want to make your vote count, all you have to do is log on to the CBBC website, which is www.bbc.co.uk forward slash CBBC. Now, you guys only have a few more days to get your votes in for Best Entertainment, so make it count. That's right. And while you're at your computer, why not send us an email? CBBC at bbc.co.uk. Let us know what you're up to. Let us know how your preparations for Christmas are getting underway. Right now, though, here's Keenan and Kel. I was just, I want you to promise me something. What? No matter how long your hair grows, yep. please never wear it in bunches like Keenan does. Oh, okay. I just don't think it's manly. Oh, fine. Anyway, right. Keenan and Kel will be back with you at the same time tomorrow. And don't forget, over the festive periods, we're joining you until quarter past ten every single morning. That's right, we'll be bringing you Basil Brush, the Cramp Twins, the Wild Thornberrys, North Pole with great prizes and Christmas crab and fish. As well as all that, Andrew and Angelica will be joining you this afternoon from 3.45. Don't miss the final Eureka today at quarter past four. Have a good day. Bye. I'm for Clifford, the big red dog. Oh, it's cold out there. Still, I can take my scarf off and now I'm in the warm with you. Look at this. It's the great CBeebies paper chain. Every link has been sent in from a different part of the country. Thank you if you sent one in to us. Take a look and see if you can see it. Oh, look, there's one there with I love CBeebies on. Very good. What have we got here? Some lovely pictures and some stars. And a rainbow link. I like that one. More stars because it is Christmas. Oh, there's the one with lots of paint on. And some colouring. And a shiny one there. Oh, shiny. And look at this. It's the CBeebies Christmas tree. Hello, Sue. Oh, hello, Sid. <laughs> what are you doing? I'm just checking around this side of the tree to make sure the decorations look nice. Oh, it's looking good. Can I help you decorate it? Oh, yes, I've got some decorations just down there. Oh, look at this one. I'm going to put that one on. I like that. There we go. You know, I think we should stop now, though, Sid, because it's time for Clifford the Big Red Dog. Oh, great. It's Christmas! Hello, John Peel here with news of a remarkable Christmas gig. Chris Evans on vocals, Noddy Holder on drums, Elton John on piano, and Spud on the Christmas tree. For the first time on television, let alone the same stage, it's Bob the Builder's Christmas to Remember on Monday the 23rd of December at 3.45 on BBC One. I can't wait. 
Oh, I love Clifford the Big Red Dog. And I love Christmas. I especially like dressing the tree. Come on, Sue, let's dress the tree. This is the way we dress the tree. Dress the tree, dress the tree. This is the way we dress the tree on a cold and frosty morning. This is the way we dress with tinsel. Dress with tinsel, dress with tinsel. This is the way we dress with tinsel on a cold and frosty morning. This is the way we dress the tree. Dress the tree, dress the tree. This is the way we dress the tree on a cold and frosty morning. Oh. Oh, I think our tree is starting to look very good already. Yes, so do I. You know what else is looking good? The great CBeebies paper chain. Yes. And look at this, Sid. I've got some more links here. There oh, you go. Oh, hey, look at this one. It's got some lovely Christmassy shapes mixed in with coloured in crayon. Very nice. And this one was sent in by Taylor, aged three and a half. Thanks, Taylor. Yeah, it's very nice. Now, Charlotte Smith has sent in a kind of seaside Christmas link here with lots of shells and glitter. Thank you, Charlotte. Thanks, Charlotte. I've got another one here with lots of shapes and colours, and this time it's got some glitter all around it. And was sent in by Rosie, who's four. Thanks very much, Rosie. Now let's watch Bing come, and let's see if he sees any trees. For the rest of this week, all your CBeebies favourites will be waking a little later. Join CBeebies weekdays from 10.15 for the rest of this week only. CBeebies on BBC Two. Oh, Binka like the snow. You know, BB and Bracken quite like the snow, but it's a bit cold on their paws. Still, I've got my Fimberly scarf on to keep me nice and warm because they're going to be here very soon. But before that, it's time for William and his Wish Wellingtons. Oh, what fun CBeebies is with Christmas on its way. <laughs> oh, sounds like fun all the way to Christmas here on CBeebies on BBC Two. <laughs> We're counting to Christmas here on CBeebies on Two. And look, there's a number 16 on Ellie's door. The number 16 is a 1 with a 6 next to it. Let's have a look and see what's inside. Ah, oh, it's a nice, bright fish. Pingu's going fishing later on. I wonder if he'll catch anything. Well, the Teletubbies will be counting to Christmas later too. But first, let's swim off to Thimble Valley. For the rest of this week, all your CBeebies favourites will be waking a little later. Join CBeebies weekdays from 10.15 for the rest of this week only. CBeebies on BBC Two. I think I'll make a Christmas card for Sid, just like the one that Fimbo made for Flory. Oh, and Flory made for Roly Mo. Well, let's see what the Teletubbies find now in their count to Christmas. <coughs> oh, well, I hope Dipsy gets the hat back. Well, there'll be more from the Teletubbies later on, but don't go away because Pingu's here in just a moment. <laughs> Poi made this angel for the top of the Christmas tree. I wondered where my wooden spoon had gone. I'll put it up there now. Ah, I might need someone a bit taller than me. Sid! Oh, Sue, what's the matter? Sid, could you put the angel on the top of the tree for me, please? Sure. Do -do -do -do. <laughs> Sid? <laughs> yes, there we are. How does that look? I could have done that. The tree does look good, though, Sue. Hmm. Ready for lots of presents. Oh, yes, have you got mine yet? We'll just have to wait and see. Let's watch Pingu. It's Christmas! Hello, John Peel here with news of a remarkable Christmas gig. Chris Evans on vocals, Noddy Holder on drums, 
Elton John on piano and Spud on the Christmas tree. For the first time on television, let alone the same stage, it's Bob the Builder's Christmas to Remember on Monday the 23rd of December at 3.45 on BBC One. I can't wait. Children as young as two can use a computer mouse. So, why not let them? Go to www.bbc.co.uk slash cbbs and try it. It's another way to play from... CBBS. This is CBeebies on two, and I'm Sydney. Now, are you having great fun? Are you ready to dance? Are you ready to sing? Are you ready to play with the tweenies? <laughs> For the rest of this week, all your CBeebies favourites will be waking a little later. Join CBeebies weekdays from 10.15 for the rest of this week only. CBeebies on BBC Two. Have a look at this great CBeebies paper chain. It's getting longer and longer. Yes, it is. And look, here's another couple to add to it. Oh, good. look at this one. This is from James. And we've got some snowballs on there and lots of different crayon colours. Very nice. Thanks, James. Yeah, and Gemma. Gemma Heathcliff has sent this one in to us. And I love the hearts and the stars. Thank you, Gemma. <laughs> now, Sid, do you like tubby custard? Mm. Well, the Teletubbies do. And they're here now. OK. <laughs> <laughs> 